calling Internal Revenue Service. How can I help you? Hello? Yes, this is Internal Revenue Service. How can I help you? Yeah, I got a voicemail. Okay, when did you get a voicemail, ma'am? 20 minutes ago. Okay, on which phone number where I'm talking to you? The 9810. That is correct? Yes. Okay. Now, I want to verify your first name and your last name, ma'am. Can you help me with this? Who am I speaking with? This is Officer Victor Frank. You are speaking Officer Victor Frank. Oh, okay. My name is Billy Rubina. How do you spell, ma'am? Billy Rubina. How do you spell your first name? With my mouth. With my mouth. How do you spell your first name, ma'am? Oh, Billy Rubina. Billy, B-I-L-L-Y. That is correct? Yeah, Billy Rubina. And your last name? It's Hernandez. And I want to verify I want to verify your zip code, ma'am. Can you help me with this? Seven three three zero one. Your three three zero one. Okay, all right. I just got it. Just don't learn, ma'am. I'll pull up your all information. Why did you get in the phone call from my side, ma'am? Okay. okay. Ah, can you hurry up? Because I'm a very hungry. You need to hurry up, please. Because I have to go to my lunch. Ma'am, it is. It's lunch time. Oh, ma'am. It is. Okay, ma'am. It is very important call, ma'am, for you. Your first name is, ma'am. I spell it for you. B I L L Y and R U B I N A. That is correct. What a boy. Yeah, you got it. Billy Rubina. B I L L Y. Billy. Mm -hmm. R U B I N A. That is correct. Billy Rubina. Yes, you got it. Mm -hmm. And your last name is. Your last name is H E R N A N D E Z U. That is correct. Yes. Are you please hurry up because I'm a very hungry. It's lunch time. Who is hungry, ma'am? I'm a very hungry woman. Hungry, no angry. Hungry. You. Hungry, hungry. I need to eat. I need to get my food. Okay. I need to get my okay. fuel, oh. my gasoline. You get all my gasoline. I'm sorry? How young are you? How young are you? Can you tell me what's this call about? I'm not here to waste the time. I am asking you, ma'am, how young are you? Are you trying to waste my time or how what? How old are you? Please do not waste my time. Sorry? Are you talking about IRS or are you talking about something else? What's going on? Don't make me... I'll give each and F. Well, you better hurry up. You're just... How young are you? You sound very silly. Just give me the information, please. Ma'am, but... The information which you are giving me, ma'am, in my system is going incorrect. So is this a mistake or what? Yeah, I think some mistake because your first name is, I guess, mistake. It's a problem with the system. Oh my god. What? Hello? Yes, ma'am? Why are you saying, oh my god, what? Because, ma'am, in my system, you're just that's why I'm asking you, ma'am, how old are you? Oh, I'm a 35. 45? 30, 35, 35. 35, ma'am, okay. Ma'am, can you help me with your current phone number? Your yeah. Phone number? 984. Are you Yaldi? Are you Yaldi, Karo, please? Are you hurry up? I am a very impatient lately. I don't know why. I think it's 2020. It's making me this way. Yes, ma'am. I'm there. I just pull up your all information, ma'am. But in my system, the information which you are giving me, ma'am, is incorrect. So that's why I'm, I'm asking you, can you please give me correct one. Yeah. Billy Rubina Hernandez. Phone number is... Na all right, ma'am. Let's be online. I'll pull up your all information, okay? Again, you're going to try to pull out. Okay. I hope you get it this time, Victor. What's your name, Victor, right? This is, this is Officer Victor Frank. Should I call you Officer or just Victor? No. You call me Officer Victor Frank. Ah, I just want to call you Victor. You're a human being. I'm a human being. What to do? Thank you for holding the line. Can you hear me now? Yeah. I'm listening. Now, now the reason behind giving a phone call was to inform you that there is a low shoot filed against your name by the Internal Revenue Service regarding your tax deficiency. I haven't you filed my taxes. Situation? I haven't filed my taxes for the year 2019. Are you? So maybe that is the okay, problem. Okay, are you aware of the situation? 
No. Ma'am, I'm not talking about your. I'm not talking about 2019. I'm talking about 2013 to 2018. Okay. Oh, that's a long time ago. So what happened there? Before I explain you about this law, should please grab a piece of a paper and pen with you so that I can provide you my information along with your case file number. Okay, just give me one minute. I don't have a pen. Are you still listening to me? Hello. Yeah, I'm there. Yes, I'm ready can you with, hear me? with a piece of pen. Uh huh. I have the piece of pen. Okay. Okay, now I want to write it down. My name. My name is Officer Victor Frank. Okay, Victor Frankie. Mm hmm. Badge ID. Okay. And after that, you write it down. My badge ID number. My badge ID number. G Agent Government. S Agent Sam. Mm hmm. The number seven. Zero seven zero three, three one. one. All right. I think I've talked to you before. And what is your, what is your date of birth? Yes, go ahead. Date of birth. My date of birth. Mhm. Mm okay. Write it down. My date of birth. One nine. One nine. Nine. Mhm. Mm one nine nine three. And what okay. is? Uh, now, what I is your social security okay. no social security number, please? You are my social security number. Mhm. Mm four, the last four digit. I will not give. No, my give me the complete one. Digit, give me the complete one, because I have to make sure I'm talking to the right officer. Okay. What is it? You can verify my last four digit. Four one four two, the last four. Give me the first four digits of your social. I I'll, I'll give. You my last four digits. Okay. You can verify my last four digits social security number. Okay. All right. That that's now, fair enough. I want to. Okay. Now I want to verify. I want to write it down now. Your case file number. See agent Charlie. Repeat for me your side, ma'am. All okay. about. Can you repeat it? It's officer Victor Frank. Batch ID GS seven zero twenty one. Date of birth one nine ninety three. Social Security four one four two, case ID CP one four zero zero four two. Okay, before I explain you, ma'am, about and what is my okay? What is my arrest warrant number? Your case, your your case file number is ma'am four one zero zero four two. That is. But my arrest warrant. I'll give each and every information, ma'am. First of all, I need to give some information oh, okay. about the case. So after that, I. I will explain you what is going on. Let me tell you, ma'am. Actually, we have done our audit in your tax filing between the year of 2013 and 2018. Can you and speak a little that, bit louder, there please? Ma'am, listen to me very, very carefully. Okay. Actually, we have done an audit in your tax filing, ma'am, between the 2013 and 2018. And we found that there is a tax deficiency under your name worth the amount of three thousand eight hundred sixty-eight dollars. Did you got it? Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Now we have discovered strong evidence, ma'am. That is the war, not a result of innocence, negligence, rather with the reason to believe that it was a willful. Action with the in intention, ma'am, to the defraud the Internal Revenue Service. Shoot name of the taxes, fraud your name. That's the reason, ma'am. Internal Revenue Service has filed a law suit against your name. Did you understand? No. I'm explaining you once again for you. Okay. We have discovered. We have discovered. Strong evidence, ma'am, that is was to a result of innocent negligence, rather with a reason to believe that is was to willful act done with an innocent a deep road to the, the Internal Revenue Service. That's the reason Internal Revenue Service has filed a law suit against your name. Did you understand? Kind of, uh, it's a very confusing, especially because, like the way you're reading it and everything, I'm just a little bit like, 
What's going on, you know? Ma'am, ma'am, I'll give each and every information. First of all, ma'am, do you know what does the tax deficiency mean? 